Okay, let's do some late night Animal Crossing. I'll play this for a little while, I don't know how long. As I do have work in the morning tomorrow, but... If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking as usual. I've been neglecting my village, so, you know, I want to put more of an effort in. Hello there, Mayor Will. And oh yes! It's Wednesday, March 8th. It is not that time, it is, uh... <laughs> 12 hours after that time. Just put the AM there. Okay. I just can't use my normal time zone because... If I do, it's just night time. Okay. Six forty-four a.m. What are you doing up so early? Oh no! Wait, is that for real? Okay. Oh, I will donate to your cause. It's just I need I need time to. Amass some money. What is this? Oh, the time capsule. Shit. Put it back. Put it back. Put it back. I forgot about. I forgot about it. <laughs> I forgot about it. You're alone. Time. Fair enough. No, I just- I only ask because I- I am not a morning person. Oh crap, hang on. I don't think I buried the time capsule. I wasn't supposed to dig that up yet. Read. Is this okay for me to do? Um, okay, hang on. I, <laughs> time cap. I can always quit the menu. I can always quit the menu, but I feel like I shouldn't be opening this. Okay, hang on. Time capsules are given to the player. Yep, yep, yep. Occasional villages would approach. Villagers become upset if their time capsule is opened. <laughs> Uh <laughs> let's just uh let's just yeah hey this is this is where the VOD starts uh hey I haven't done anything bad You're not a morning person either you go back to bed later. Yeah damn that alone time must be very important. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, just, just do it again. But this is gonna happen more than once. I need to put something there to remind me not to unearth it. Yeah, I know. That's fine. That's okay. I, I, I am aware of this. See, no harm done. It's still there. Um, that was probably a bad idea to put it there, but then again, where, where, where was I going to put it? I had a lot of fun visiting you at home. Your place is great. You're a real sport for letting me play with all your toys. I got something to put on your walls. Breathe from my mom? What? I hope- I hear your home is expanding. Use this to fill your new space. I'm proud of you. Why is it still blinking? Oh no, it's soft. Okay. Uh... 
Epum. Present. Epum. I got a spa chair, but I don't have a spa. Also, you can't put furniture in inside, so an indoor spa. Okay, let's go see what this looks like. Oh, I mean, if I'm gonna have an old TV, I guess I should have a phonograph, but... <laughs> Wait, what? Huh? Wait, did I... No, that, that was the sp... What? Is this a stack of spa chairs or is this these like the actual spa chair? What is this? Like it looks like I'm I'm selling chairs. <laughs> Why would anyone want this in their house? I'm going to go sell that for sure. And then we have a modern wall. No. Modern wall clock. But I already have a clock, don't I? I have that one. Which you can't really see, so. I don't know, I wouldn't call that modern. It's, like, it's kind of old school, really. It's it's a wooden clock. Um, I'll put it away because it, it's something that looks visually okay. I'm gonna have to organize my stuff a lot better. Into things that I may want to put out and decorate, and then things that I guess I should sell. I don't know. I guess it's easy enough to remember not to dig up in front of the fountain. I wonder if all my villagers are happy now. And they've stopped trying to fight one another. Wait, what is this? Should I have... I mean, maybe they were just weeds. Oh, Sahara's here. I am called Sahara, for that is my name. I come from a faraway land. I have many wallpapers for the papering of walls, many carpets for the petting of cars. Three th Ugh, yeah, okay. Do it. I'll do one. Oh, this is different. Wait, Sahara follows you to your place? Okay, this is different. Um. Well. I guess as long as I have... Oh, you get both for 3,000? Really? It's way different. In New Horizons, Sahara just sells stuff and... 
you get to pick a you get a unique random carpet and a unique random wall, and then there's just ru different rugs on sale. So Sahara is like a interior decorator here. Ah, this is your place, yes? Oh, I see the harmony of this room. I have just the thing, yes, yes. Now I will accept the payment. Oh, oh no, ooh. She's greedier in New Horizons. It would appear so, yeah. But she's ruder here. She called me poor. She called me poor. It's like, oh, no, 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 no. No, you're too poor. I can't help you. Nothing wrong with having a strong business sense. Just. Ah, uh, Sahara. It is done. Done like the past. Tomorrow is here. The future needs not this, so you must take it. Oh, I got to keep all my old stuff. Cool. My vision is yours. You will like it, yes? <laughs> Sahara, please, I need to get inside my house. I would like to see what you, what, 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 what'd you do? What? <laughs> this looks like a vacant lot now. Then again. Then again. The corn kind of makes sense now. Did this happen because of the corn? That this happened because I had corn in the ground. So Zahara was like, oh, no, no, no. The corn looks ridiculous inside a carpet. It must be on ground. I'm kind of impressed. Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit impressed. I, I will leave it like this for the time being. How did... how did she know? <laughs> okay. Excuse me. Hey, what's up, Will? Re-rack? So anyway, did you need something? Let's chat. The other day I was reading this interior design magazine. There was this article, putting your stuff on your other stuff. Pretty good piece, actually. It got me thinking how I've had the same round mini cactus in my room forever. So if I'm gonna make a change, it seems like a good place to start. If you come across anything like that, will you let me know about it? I'm looking for something you put on top of other furniture. Got it, Rerack? Oh. Uh. I don't. I don't think I have anything that fits that description. What about a tire? Whoops. It's okay. I'll fill it in in a minute. speaking terms again, I see. It's been one week, so I just assumed we were in a fight. No! I- D D Blanche, I was playing Kirby! <laughs> I was playing Kirby! Well, I'm glad to hear everything is okay, so... Quite good. Quite so. It's good to talk to you again. See, this is what happens. I was- I was just playing Kirby. That's got to be, like, the harshest good to see you again I've seen <laughs> in this game so far. Oh, well, look who's here. Ugh. 
clear this cheese. <laughs> maybe... <sighs> no, I'm not gonna do it. Like, I'll... I was gonna say maybe I should get, like, a, ma a large mouse pad that isn't black and then it would be easier to see the stylus. But then I'm getting a mouse pad just purely so I don't lose my, my stylus. I think there's a better way to solve this. I think I just need to get, like, a cup and put it here or something and put pens in it. Or maybe I should just buy a stylus for this DS. That might be a, a better solution, but... Maybe I'll go down and um, have a look at like a secondhand shop or something. Because that's where I found the Wii U Pro Controller. I just... Went to a secondhand store and they really happened to have one, so I got, got it. The problem with getting them brand new is like most of them come in these these accessory packs. It's not like you can go out and just buy a stylus. Sometimes they'll come in packs of like three. Or they'll come with a carry case or something. Or maybe something to hold your games. And I, I don't I don't want any of that. I just I just want one stylus. That's it. <laughs> If I, why would I why would I need three? I, I guess in case I lose one. But then I, I would have to keep the other two stored somewhere else. Like you go into the effort of making sure you don't lose the other the other two in case you lose your primary one. And I like keeping my DS games in their original boxes, so I don't like using those those things that carry multiple cards. This just seems clunky. Oh, are we ever going to be able to do anything here? Nope, okay. Dude's been tired for almost a month now. Did someone put a air conditioner for sale? Uh, I mean... YouTube or your games are never in the right case. Does it become a thing where you play a game and then... You know, you take it out and you put the previous game you were playing in the case of the game that you're about to play. And so eventually it, everything just shuffles by one. There's no space to sell, so... I mean, maybe one of the villagers will just randomly be like, Oh, I can see inside your pockets. Sell me this. I'm surprised no one's replaced Lucky yet. But yeah, I think that's the inherent downside of those cases that hold multiple games, is like, if you lose that case, you're not just losing one game, you're losing whatever you have stored in there. And that's... What convenience are you getting, really, from keeping all your games in, like, one little cut space like that? I guess if you're traveling, sure, but... I don't know. You happen to like what I'm wearing. It was designed by someone from any town. What? This particular design is called T-shirt. Isn't that a nice baffle? 
It was did I just get placeholder text? <laughs> cause no cause it can't get the information from anyone. I mean how many people are still playing this game? I keep forgetting to check here. Yeah. What is that? Round electric sign. Yeah, I'll take. Why not? I kind of like how that looks. I'll... I'll go hang it in front of my washing machine. I'm sure the sign says washing machine. I've made some money. Oh no, it's like kind of in an awkward spot. There we go. That's uh that's the sign for fire extinguisher. I wouldn't be able to fit the washing machine there. Oh, right. This got undone. Just got undone. So I have a bunch of stuff that I need to sell. It's a long story. <laughs> but I decided to play another game on my 3DS and stream it and then... I guess I didn't save the previous day so... I lost one day worth of progress and in that one day I had a bunch of stuff from the previous day. I mean, cool, because I guess I make more money today. I can probably finish the fountain. Probably not gonna get me to ten thousand, but Half of them will do for cuts. Yeah, 
me out to sell the others. I don't know if I'm just unlucky, but I seem to be getting more duplicates. Or maybe there's just not as many to find. Dispose of this trash that I have. I'm curious. Surely the can doesn't cost as much as a tire. Whoops. <laughs> Rip that flower. I wish it, that wasn't the case, but it's not as bad as the tire. Like, I, I can- I can bear that. <laughs> I should just stop piling the tires on Sidia. And they- they have to get rid of the, them themselves. more stuff from storage to sell. Yeah, that was the lost possession that I never found who it belonged to. Too late now. I tried talking to everyone after, and no one wanted it. Wait, I can't- I can't even... throw it away? <laughs> what do I do with it? Are they just gonna get angry at me because- uh. I know who it belongs to, the problem is they weren't around on the day that I found it. Greetings are really important, don't you think? You have a good greeting and right away you get an idea of what the person's all about. You think there's some kind of greeting that would make me help make the best impression? Uh, as long as it's not re-rack. Okay, hate. I don't even know what to use. Every time this pops up, I never have an answer because it's always late. Well, I guess... Let's just pretend like, you know, she roars. Yeah. Damn it! <laughs> Didn't get rid of Rerack. I don't know where that came from, but everyone's saying it. I don't know what it means. Thank <laughs> you. 
I can't, I can't sell it. What, 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 do, what do I do? Wait, not the spa chair. Am I just stuck with this? <laughs> I might have to look this up in the wiki. Villager tasks, hang on. Lost item. Okay, here we go. After two days have passed, hang on, after two days have passed and can be, and it is able to be dropped, mail, or disposed of. It says paper bag. So, I'm guessing I can take it to retail. charge the fee, aren't I? I can't buy this item, so you'll have to pay a disposal fee! Ah! <laughs> uh, that's- is that more than the tire? It is. For a paper bag! A hundred and twenty bells to dispose of a paper bag. I was robbed. Okay. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's one of these. <laughs> They're not even worth any money, look. Should just get rid of it. Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna leave it there. Ah, oh, this game played this on a ton. Yeah, I n never got to play this. My first one was New Horizons. And people have always said that this one has things that are better, so I wanted to check it out. But hello, Solo Candy. I can see why. New Horizons has way more options to decorate, but this one seems to have a bit more to do, in general. Between random events and just, I guess, the amount of stuff like fruit. And activities. There are some things I do miss from New Horizons already, though, like... Auto-stacking is probably number one. I'm just gonna ignore that.
Oh yeah, that reminds me. Hang on. Sorry, I'm just looking this up. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, they haven't sold me a slingshot, and I think I know why. It just something occurred to me, and I looked it up, and that is indeed the case. You love this game? Yeah. We've heard a lot of good things about it. And I figured, since I modded this DS to be able to capture stuff, why not? I've been wanting to play chill games lately, because... Yeah. <laughs> I've been leaning too much on the side of, uh... Of games that kind of annoy me. Well, not annoy me, but, you know, make me salty. Oh, and thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Sometimes you just need to chill. Exactly. Honestly, this this game was... Was great for the pandemic. Definitely... Helped, uh... Keep the sanity levels. We made a lot. I'll probably never be able to forget your face now, Rerack. So anyway, did you need something? No. How about this? Oh, right, yeah. No. Dude, that, are you going to toy, my, toy of my... What is it with these villagers? They use such strong language. Yeah, I, I kind of wish I had played this at its peak, but when I got my 3DS, it was just a couple of months before they announced the Switch. So I, I kind of missed the boat. Um, maybe I actually have to spend money here. I'll take it. Okay, so, what was it? Not this. The Patchwork Surfer. So, I'm gonna try and flip this. <laughs> I'm gonna try and flip it. Oh wait, Anacardi was- hang on, hang on, Anacardi was here. Anacardi was looking at something. Anacardi was looking at this. Anacardi, buy, buy this, buy this, buy this, buy it, do it. It's a vegetarian shirt, apparently. <laughs> buy it, do it, do it. I'm just wait. I'm gonna wait. They just stare at it for a little while and then eyes light up and they want to buy it. The reason I'm so eager is because I put this at a ridiculous markup, <laughs> and it just gets sold. Buy it. Do it. No, no, not the air conditioner. The Regal Vanity? Yeah, you know what? Go for it, because then it makes room. Damn it. Okay. Mm-mm. 
I don't understand this item. It says spa chair, but look, look at how it looks like. It's a stack of chairs. <laughs> It's, it's not what the item describes, it's, it's, it's a stack of chairs. Anyway. Now what I used to play, uh, quite a bit, late at night. My late at night go-to used to be Harvest Moon. I forgot which one it was. I think it was... It was either the one on the DS or... The Game Boy one. Maybe even both at, like, at different points in time, but... It's the farming sim. Just was a nice way to kind of just clear the mind of the day. Okay, let's try and give her this flower. You likey? Oh, no. Minimalist dresser? No, but I paid a lot of money for that. She's not getting it for free. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Besides, it has to be an item that goes on top of another item, so it doesn't fit the bill. I'll see what I have back at home. Too many dresses. It's alright, I'll sort my... my house later. Once I have stuff that I can... can actually deal with. So what do we have? We have instruction manual, goldfish trophy, ice closet, mommy's casket, sofa, bed, a lantern. Bowling pins, wagon wheel, blue chair, a pop-up book. Let's do a pop-up book. See if that works. I held on to the trash because I, I thought maybe this was like New Horizons and they were crafting recipes and the trash would be useful. But little did I know that the trash is just, no, you're, lo you're losing money. You get punished for cleaning up the environment in this town. Is there something you need? Yes, just... Third time... Yeah. A pop-up book? Nice. This is perfect. I'll try it out as soon as I get home. Alright, let me give you a thank you gift. Take this. Heh <laughs> Hope you like your new blue war- I just- <laughs> I have too many wardrobes. It could replace the pear one, though. Let's see. Uh, blue... No, it's pear. Yeah, I, I guess that suits more? Question mark? I don't know. Put it away. What else have I got that I... I don't really use gyroids ever. I'm gonna sell them. I oh, see, I still got stuff to sell. Okay. The one thing I am kind of surprised about New Horizons is that 
they're not... They've already stopped making content for it. I thought they would keep going with it for at least a little bit longer. What does that sound? Oh, right. Caught a flea. Oh no, now I'm itchy. We have an infestation. What? I had a flea on me? Ew, I try so hard to stay clean too. Um... Did you promise not to tell anyone? It's so embarrassing, bah. Yes, flip. Hey, well, hmm. Well, well. Yes. Let's think of something new to call you. <laughs> Go for it. Try this one on for size. Bro. I know, right? Alright, you can do it. Okay, then that tells you she'll be known as bro. I feel like I'm your king or something now, Count. Oh, right. <laughs> I, f I forgot about the Count thing. That's, that's great. You know what? I'm not going to give context to the Count thing. If you were here for it, you were here for it. but they are referring to me as a count. Some of them, not all of them. I mean, this is the appropriate reaction for a flea. I haven't really gone in here. How is how is this looking now? It's still. <laughs> It's still pretty empty. <laughs> okay, it's fine. Oh! You're here. Hey, sweetie, you, you come here to see fish too? Well, good for you, and by the way, ow. So did you need something? Let's chat. There's not much to look at, but at least it's turning a bit more into an actual aquarium, right? Yeah. No, that is true. I mean, I don't know how full how full this is gonna get. It's like there's there's a question mark on how much I'm gonna play of this. But at some point, I feel like it will reach its logical conclusion, whether it's 100%ing it or not. After Stardew, I, I just felt like I wanted to do more of a chill game. Sell that item because I'm lazy. Nay, look at that. Okay, cool. But yeah, the reason these stores aren't changing is, I guess, because I'm not stimulating the local economy. 
So I'm not buying stuff, so that's why they're not they're not becoming anything else. So I just spent money today for the heck of it. The problem is so low, no matter how hard I work, it feels like I get nowhere. What? Hold up a sec, sis. Haven't we had this conversation before? Make something high quality and make it fast on the cheap. Sound familiar? Who says those exact words like they're quickly going out of style? But, Mabel, you take pride in your work like I do, right? I mean, our hearts go into making clothes, don't they? So, don't you want to be able to offer them with for a low price that customers will prefer? Ah, the customers might just be fine with it, but you aren't, sis. You aren't a machine. Look, just forget about it. I've always loved that worker bee mentality of yours anyway. What? Come again, Mabel? Did you say something? I was lost in thought there, thinking about my work, so I didn't hear you. Tee hee hee. I didn't say a word, sis. You just keep on working. I'm going to buy this, this L shirt. The sporty vibe of Little Bro's tea is nice. Oh, this is a small store, but we have new items. Yeah. I mean, I should get into the habit of buying clothing. But the only reason I did that was because of that. In, in the words of Luigi, the L is for winner. I forgot what game that was shown in. Oh, hold, on, hold, on, hold, on, hold 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 on, stop, 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 I really like the looks of the vegetarian tea over there, but I don't know about the price. You only live once, Frigo, you only live once. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity, the history behind this t-shirt, let me tell you. You must think I'm pretty gullible, your item is way too overpriced and you know it. No, it's not. This isn't overpriced, it was worn by John Vegetarian. The first vegetarian ever. Right, so no one's gonna buy it for that price. That's more or less what it's worth. I was curious. <sighs> I'm so unhappy about these disposal fees. You know the old saying, you get what you pay for, well it's not always true in this shop. That's because anyone can list an item for sale and they can choose whatever price they want. You can find some good bargains, but remember that other old saying, buyer beware. Hey, sweetie, I'm thinking about buying your balloon lamp. Do you think the price is fair? Yeah. Alright, I was hoping you'd say that. Now back to shopping. I've got more bargains to hunt. Okay, good. I, I can't remember how, how much I put it up for. But I guess I got my money back.
I have to go back soon, don't I? Okay, no. I might be able to pick all these up. I guess they're all getting along today. <laughs> no one wants to fight someone. So that's good. But given what happened, I, I get the feeling that's why Lucky moved out. I don't think that was worth it. I thought that was gonna sell for way more. Okay. Guess not. Alright, I'm gonna go do an island thing. Since they're, they're pretty fun. I love the sentence, we'll probably be here. You, you don't want that. You don't want the word probably. I mean, fair point. <laughs> Don't you pull any hair. Don't you toss them any bugs. Hold them doors, hold them hands. Be charming. If you want them hugs. <laughs> what is this song? Do sunflowers... Need lots of sun to grow. I guess maybe that's just a superstition. This feels like the lyrics to this were generated by AI or something. Like, this is the chat GPT. I haven't been here in a while. <laughs> Greetings from Germany. Hello, Jeffrey. Welcome. Go on a tour. Which one? Wait, have I done this one? I don't think I've done this song. I'll do this song. Yeah, how's your uh, day going so far? Hey there, Whippersnapper. Thanks for joining us on the Butterfly Discovery Tour. Let's catch some butterflies. Keep an eye out for common butterflies, yellow butterflies, tiger butterflies, and any others. 
You catch three within five minutes, I'll give you medals. Wait, that's it? Three? It might be easier said than done. There's one, there's one, there's one, there's one. There's one! Come here. You miss Animal Crossing New Leaf. Your game got bugged and it says your city doesn't exist and you also can't make a new one. Oh no. Damn, that sucks. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing with some of those cartridges is like, they don't last forever. But I mean, otherwise, glad to hear that you're doing good. Now, this is my first time playing it because uh, I played New Horizons first. As my first uh, Animal Crossing game. And, I mean, people always talked about New Leaf. So, I was curious, and since I got my DS modified to be able to stream games on that, I figured, ah, give it a try. Plus, since, you know, this is probably the time where people are having nostalgia for the DS since the eShop is closing. It's a, it's a good time to visit it again, I think. <laughs> but, yeah. I'm slowly going through my, my backlog of stuff that I've been wanting to do for a while. Game, please. I'm so bad at this because oh, this thumbstick. Oh, and thank you for the follow. I appreciate that a lot. The first Animal Crossing game was Wild World. Uh, what console was that on? Or oh, handheld? Was that the DS one or? I think the GameCube one was just called Animal Crossing. The first Nintendo DS, yeah, that's what I meant by DS. Like, the original DS. <laughs> May as well get these. Yeah, I mean, I had never heard of this uh, series until New Leaf. Yeah, there's a streamer I watch, like a popular one called, I mean, Vinny, Vine Source. So he did a playthrough of it, and that's how I became aware of Animal Crossing as a concept. And I was going to get it when I got my 3DS, but then when I got my 3DS a couple of months later, the Switch was announced, so... I kind of missed the boat on it. get to experience the multiplayer and I, I guess at its peak I'm sure people would have been visiting each other's towns and whatnot but I think it's fine like I enjoy just having this as something I do from time to time to unwind The multiplayer was fun. Yeah, if it was anything like how it was in New Horizons. I mean, I can, I can definitely imagine. I'm impressed by these little mini-games already. 
I, I think New Horizons had them, but they were kind of smaller in scope. You missed the island games from New Leaf and New Horizons. Yeah. Because they, uh, from memory, they did do them, but they were like a once-off thing from memory. Like, you didn't get to do them again. There was like a, a labyrinth one. What was the other one? But it was it was a once-off thing from what I remember, which was a bit sad. I would like to take this fruit back, thank you. It's, it's a nice way to make money and just keep it varied. Um, the Labyrinth one is fun, but it, it just doesn't let you bring back stuff. Wait, have I done Scavenger? Huh? I don't think I've done Scavenger. Let's do Scavenger. Yar. The other thing I gotta keep an eye on is the time. It's late here. I do have work in the morning. I just wanted to play this for a little bit before wrapping up. But this game is so easy to just be playing it and then you look at the time and it's like, oh crap. List of furniture that you need to find. Check your pockets for scavenger hunt list. Six minutes to find everything on your list and report back to me. If you report back to me within the time limit, you'll be awarded with medals. Don't forget to come back here after you find it so I can verify your findings. Don't even think about bringing me something that's not listed. Okay. Cabana table, writing desk, Pachira, whatever that is. What do I do? Do I just shake trees and hope for the best? Or are they just lying around? This is off to a great start. I haven't found anything. Don't get me wrong, New Horizons is nice, but for you it's missing something and you like New Leaf more. Yeah, no, I, I think from what I've seen, New Horizons is better from like a decoration point of view. And getting people to visit your island, like... That aspect of it is, is good. But it kind of lacks in the just general day to day. <laughs> Especially when you look at it when it released. Like, I know they added stuff, but it, it still feels like there's still quite a bit of a void compared to this. Oh, I may have missed the point of this. Ah, okay. Well, I mean, the answer is just grab everything and then just ditch anything I don't like. Display. 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 <laughs> None 
<laughs> None of this was on my list. What a waste of time. I didn't even look at the lower screen. Just look at the houses, but now it makes now it makes sense what I'm supposed to be doing. What is this? This is Cabana Dress, alright, that's one of the items. What was the other item? Uh Oh no wait, it's Cabana Table, not Cabana Dresser. Damn it. And then writing desk. I gotta I gotta go. It's not here. Okay, but now I know what I'm looking for from a style point of view. I'm probably not gonna succeed here. <laughs> Don't have much time left. Unless I get super lucky and it's all in one house. We'll see. Uh, that looks like a right- no. Alright, just get it. That's the writing chair display. This is the writing table. The writing desk. We got the writing desk. I don't know what a Pachura is. I'm just gonna pick this up. And see if it just says what Pachura is. I can safely assume that <laughs> those are golf clubs. Large alpine table, nope. Writing desk, nope. Nope, okay. It has to be in the last house, alright. It has to be in the last house. I got like 30 seconds! <laughs> exactly. Okay, just grab- just grab everything in the last house! Oh, crap. Uh, table, and then this. Let's just quickly check. Eh. No, I've- I've lost this. <laughs> I don't know what a- I don't know what a pachera is! I'm gonna re I'm gonna retry. Now that I understand how this works, I spent like the first minute and a half just looking at trees. Pachira is a plant. That's why I don't know it. <laughs> I, don't, I know nothing about plants. Despite my, my mom like really liking plants. We're doing, we're doing it again. I'm getting it this time. You only know because of Animal Crossing. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, no, my, my parents went on a trip once and my mom got me to look after the plants. Along with my brothers, but mainly me. And I did a good job, except I, I accidentally killed a cactus. So, you know, I didn't get into trouble. She laughed at me. She said I was less nurturing than a desert. Which I, I guess is true. Okay, we are after a regal lamp, a classic buffet, and a coat hanger. Classic buffet? Table? Well... Regal table. 
So, Riggles, it's gonna be like that. Kadanga should be fine. Classic buffet, maybe? Classic buffet, okay. Much better already. That would be the regal lamp. Okay, now we just need the coat hanger. And the turtle guy was the old mayor in Wildwood. I think they did make a reference to that in this. Used to be the mayor. I like his name. Crisis of elimination, <laughs> we are here. That, that, that would have to be it, right? It's amazing what you can do when you go into houses and not shake trees. You did it, Sprout! You found all of the furniture on your list. <laughs> it's not going to be many medals, is it? I wasn't sure you had it in you, but I guess I was wrong. Your performance has earned a gold tournament award with nine medals. Nice. Hope you enjoyed the easy scavenger tour. Tell your friends. Um, there's a bug catching tour. I do like that you can just keep going on them, instead of having to repurchase the ticket. <laughs> yeah. That's what you have to do in New Horizon, just grind the Nook Miles to be able to do anything. Oh, you better believe I'm using this as a chance to get this as well. Pretty good. You get fruit, and you also get activities. Okay, hang on. Before I continue, do the old border stack. I haven't seen a single bug yet. You're back. You got sleep, but I couldn't sleep. <laughs> I understand that. How did I, how, 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 how did I miss that? And your items don't break in New Leaf except the axe, right. 
I mean, the item breaking thing, it's pretty much just the pad content. I think the golden items shouldn't break. That was the sad thing, is like, you spent so much on the gold items and then they would break as well. There's a bug. Come here. This one is idiot proof. I'm gonna be lucky if I catch three. Let me catch three first and then I'll, I'll start getting mangoes. Come on, get closer. Fail, I may as well fail with mangoes. Where'd it go? It's gone. <laughs> I say something yet? Yeah, it's there. Okay, got another one. Yes! Didn't fail at that time. Okay. Well, I guess I haven't failed. It was easier to get gold items in New Leaf, just bury them for a day. Except a slingshot where you got the gold net and fishing rod that was at Wild World. I mean, I don't mind them being difficult to acquire. I think... Just conceptually, that you go through so much effort to get them and then they just break. <laughs> I was so disappointed when my first gold item broke. I was like, oh, well, I'm never making one of those again. It's just not worth it. I mean, maybe to display, sure, but to carry around the news, nah. Ah! What? How <laughs> do I keep missing? Come here. Yes, okay, I got six. I got six, I'm happy. No, I'm, I'm absolutely going to use these last ten seconds to get more fruit. No! Couldn't pick it up. Damn it. <laughs> That was a hoot. Let's take a gander at the results. Let's see here. You caught six bugs. That's enough to net you a gold Tortimer reward and six medals. Okay. A bit better than I thought. Hope you enjoy the easy bug catching tool. I did to some extent. Okay. Fruit. Look at all the fruit.
I showed up for tryouts in my best sports gear. Played like I was in a trance. I showed no fear. But when I opened my eyes, I was so surprised. I'd made the girls team, and there weren't any guys. <laughs> what? <laughs> me daughter's the apple of me eye. She teaches this old salt new things. Don't matter much if you don't got hair to comb. The thing that matters most is what's under your dome. Okay. At least, at least that one's... It makes sense. What's under your dome? I wonder if some of these are just maybe lost in translation. Well then, that put some hair on your test. Now, didn't it? Yeah. Here are your effects as promised. God damn it, cat. I can't say that word. I guess it depends what C is. But hey. Oh yeah, they changed the rules on YouTube. Apparently you can swear in the first 10 seconds of your, your video now. And you don't get punished. However, if you're swearing too much, you can still get punished. So, I don't know. There was enough backlash on it that, uh, yeah, they changed the rules. See, that's so much better. You get to do little mini games and you can earn a lot of money. How much do I have left on the fountain? So close. I just need to make 7,000 more bells. Okay. I can do that with fish. is fish. Shells are just not worth it. <laughs> oh, it's just a bee. It's okay. We're okay. bad at first time just the first time real I miss the majority of them
Oh, there's a big one there. I'll, I'll do that. I don't want to scare it. Alright, cool. That's gonna be nice towards the contribution. Should probably focus on the medium to big fish and not the little ones. Oh, crap. That was a sea bass anyway. Did I know the Australians discovered Norway? What? <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, when they found out, they were like, oh, no way. Oh, god damn it. I walked into that one. <sighs> I, can, I can imagine that you're just laughing maniacally, Cat. I can, I can already picture it, like... And you can say, no, you're not, but you, you most definitely are. You shouldn't laugh at your own jokes, cat. I can hear it across the ocean. Not your joke heard online. No, but you told it. <laughs> 10 out of 10, terrible pun, yeah. I'll tell you, the, I'll tell you this one, I've been telling Americans, if, if you want to learn how to speak Australian, Say, rise up, lights. Say that sentence quickly, repeatedly. And then congratulations, you're now speaking with an Australian accent. You don't get it? Well, that's why I said you're not an American, though. Also, thank you for the follow, Ellie. I guess you like that joke about Norway, huh? Also, good eye, yeah. Well, yeah, good eye. But rise up lights. 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 Aris... Are Australian rednecks a thing? You worked in a ski town and you swear the town was full of them. Ah, uh, yes, we call them bogans. Oh, yeah, they talk a bit like this, you know, a little bit more nasally. They talk through their nose a lot more like this, oh my god, like this. You know? And then they kind of shorten words that don't need to be shortened. They'll listen to Akadaka, you know? Bloody good band, that Akadaka. I mean, to be fair, it's not like this, it's not the same as American rednecks, but 
It's in the same realm. It's just like... They have a particular accent and yeah, it's just different way of life, I guess. Doesn't every country have their own redneck though? I mean, probably, yeah. They fit right in, it was in the redneck province of Canada. Ah. Yeah, I mean, th there's a joke that goes... ...that no matter where you go in the world, you're gonna bump into an Australian, and you know what? Th there's a lot of truth to it. One more. You never met an Australian before me. Really? But, it, yeah, I mean... I, I like to classify myself as an Australian, but I'm not like... Typical, typical Australian. I'm the most Aussie dude you know. <laughs> Damn. Well, I guess, yeah, by that token, Kat, you're like the most Swedish person I know as well. Because I guess I had, hadn't really met a Swedish person either. I'd met someone from Norway before, like, when I was in university, but... Other than that, like, Scandinavians in Australia is kind of rare. <laughs> Damn it, I walked into it again. <sighs> Stop it. Let's just see if I've missed any. Okay. Just making sure that I was on top of the fish in terms of donations. Wow, it's like a clean 10,000. Okay, that's the fountain. My private fountain. But I put here just because I want to decorate the house, let's face it. No, I, damn it.
Seven, seven, one, six, done. Oh, yeah. You got default gifted to you so you have early access and shiz. Oh, cool. I'll have early access too, but I haven't bought it. <laughs> so we can play. What am I drinking on Friday? I haven't decided yet. I'm gonna, after work, pop in and see what's around. It's still a bit warm, so I'm, I might lean into something just... Like... I don't want to say fruity, but like... Tropical stuff. <laughs> if that makes sense. Australians like their, their summer ales and stuff like that, so... After that, it doesn't really make sense. You're gonna make me drunk? <laughs> but, like, that that implies, Kat, that you're going to get legendary drops in Diablo. If you recall the last time we did this... It was like... <laughs> you got so angry at the legendary drops, because I, I think it was something like, at one point I had double digits and you were still on single digits. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go shopping on on Friday, um, after work. Do you know Do you know what I've had to become? I've I've kind of had to become like my parents that uh, have to check catalogs now. Because it's I don't know I don't know about elsewhere, but dude, inflation has hit certain things just in a stupid way. So like a bag of chips, for example, you could pick uh you know your standard brand ones. They were uh, between three to two to three dollars typically. And then when they were on special, it'd be like two dollars ish. And then your your fancier ones, they were like three dollars to four dollars, four fifty if you were desperate. Now that they're seven to eight dollars, and so that's what I'm saying. I have to check catalogs and go on the day that those catalogs start because otherwise I'm going to be paying like. Seven to eight dollars for a bag of chips, which is just insane. Another one the other day was like, and this one's more adult, but dishwasher tablets it was sixty dollars. Takis, uh. Five to seven dollars and you become obsessed. Yeah, it's, it's just... It's, it kind of sucks right now. So I guess that's what I mean. Like, I haven't really planned anything because uh, I'm honestly going to play it by ear. And just see, okay, yeah, that's at a fair price. I'll get that. And uh, yeah, it's not be it's not because it's not because I want to save money, chat. I mean, don't get me wrong, that's great. I'll I'll always try to do that where possible. But this is just one of those things where I'm sorry, I'm not gonna pay seven dollars for a bag of chips. I never look at catalogs, but when I'm shopping, I try to go for you know the item that 
Makes sense, right? Like, something that's on special or something that is reasonably priced. But now it, it is pretty much to the extent where if you want to get certain things, you have to look at the catalogue and be like, okay, th I, I need to go the day this starts. Otherwise, I'm going to be paying a ridiculous amount for something so basic. <laughs> when potato chips are on special, it looks like how it looked like during the pandemic when we went insane with the toilet paper and just the shelves were empty. That's what it's like when potato chips are on sale. It's people go mental and just empty the shelves. Because otherwise you're paying double the price. I just want to have like a little bit more of uh, a safety net when it. Did I need that? It kind of just walked into the ocean and I can only assume perished. <laughs> Cat, just so I know, like, what time do you want to start playing stuff? Since you're here, and by the time I go to sleep and wake up, you probably won't be up. Oh boy, I just lost 80, 80 bells. Cleaning up our oceans, that'll be 80 bells, please. Contributing to society, that'll be 80 bells, please. Making the world a better place, that'll be 80 bells, please. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I just, I find it just really funny that you get charged for cleaning up the town. I love when they're whistling Funky Town. Hang on, bro. It's time to take a break now. Playing too much makes you tired. What time am I done with work? Uh, shopping my time. Uh, well, I mean, typically I, I finish work at, at 5. My time. Which is really early for you in the morning, so... You know... It's Friday, so I don't have to do anything after work. So my evening is, is free, pretty much. But if I guess if I leave at 5, by 6pm my time, I'm, I'm all good. Time zone be bitchin'. Yeah, I mean, just go with whatever time is good for you, because that's night time for me and it's normal. And then we can fig we can figure it out. <laughs> I can't believe I'm being charged. 80 bells to clean up the town. Why am I being charged 80 bells? Mm. 
6 p.m. for me is 8 a.m. for you. Yeah, but I mean, I've done this before. Like, it's just. It's no different than if I was to go out for the night. If I was going to hang out somewhere for the evening, like, we'd be getting ready at 10 o'clock at night at my time and probably leaving at 11. So, don't worry. Don't worry about time too much. It's also a long weekend, so... I have no responsibilities for that entire weekend. I always make sure that's the case for long weekends. It's just, it's a good time to just... not have to worry about anything. So I can definitely sleep as much as I want. Is 3 p.m. your time too late? 1 a.m. for me? Nah, I think it's fine. It's fine. I mean, here's the other thing is like, I could always just do something before. So then it's just... Makes it easier. We've done this before, don't worry about it. It's fine. Let's see that then, alright. Yeah. I'll just- I might just chill with something beforehand. So then it's like, when the time comes, it's all good. So I've heard you have something pretty nice. Grey Parker? No. I want this hoodie. Aw, oh, see, that's polite. That is polite. I like- I like Blanche. I like Blanche. Who what? I think- who was it? Was it Anacotti? No. But, uh, you know, I had an item, they walk up to me, and they're like, can I buy it? And I'm like, no. And then they say, Psh, that's not neighborly of you. You know what, next time I'm gonna say yes for Blanche, because that was... That was a really nice way to ask. Make sure to nap somewhere in between, I will. I'm gonna- I'm gonna put this away so then they stop asking. You love Bird because he was your first villager in Wildwood and then you leave. You got the same villager twice? That's- that's pretty lucky. The odds of that are kind of crazy. That is, uh, yeah. That's pretty- Pretty good luck. I don't have anyone that I had in New Horizons in here, so everyone is unique here. I think I, I I like I like Flip. I think now like Flip and Blanche are my favorite too. I love it when the weather is like this. You can do weight training. Or just stay inside and watch sports. Like Flip's got my back. And Blanche is just is just really nice and polite. Anacotti likes to start fights. You know, Paula is is a little nosy. She seems to be in everyone's business. Don't really get to see Static much. Static is a little antisocial. Just does his own thing, but, you know, say hi to each other. And, uh, yeah, I mean, Frigga's around. I haven't really gotten to know Frigga much, but I would say, yeah, uh, Flip. You had Static and New Leaf. People are saying that just Static is not trustworthy because of the voice, just too deep of a voice. 
which I take issue with. Just because you have a deep voice doesn't mean that you're untrustworthy. This is why I don't like coming along the river to fish. Like, I feel like you don't find big fish as much on the river. This is what I'm doing, by the way, is I'm trying to look for a big fish to catch, but it's just, uh... It's not happening. Hmm. No squirrel has any business having a voice that deep. <laughs> Are you saying... Anything that's small shouldn't have a, a deep voice. I mean, I can't relate, like, I'm tall, but... Or just the squirrels specifically. Anything small, gotcha. So, like, the squirrel can't have, like, a, a Barry White voice, for example. Well, who else has a deep voice? It's like, uh, a singer of, like, uh... Is it romance? I don't know, but you know what I mean. So it's basically like sex music. I think it's just, I don't know. I don't know the genre. I'm, I'm bad with music genres, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't know why that happens sometimes. Okay, uh, I just- I just looked at the time chat, and... I gotta- I gotta skedaddle. I gotta get some rest. It is late for me, and that is the unfortunate thing of being an Australian streamer. Time zones! Ugh, just... Don't line up with anyone. I'm a- I'm a- I'm a night owl anyway. I like staying up, right? So, it's just, in the interest of being a responsible adult and making sure I get through my workday, I do need a certain amount of sleep. But, uh, I want to thank you for tuning in, especially if you're new to the stream. Thanks for popping in. Uh, yeah. Hope you had fun here. So, I will return tomorrow. So, currently what I'm doing, for those that don't know, I'm playing through every single Zelda game up until uh, Tears of the Kingdom comes out. So I'm currently up to Minish Cap. So I'll be playing that tomorrow. And then I'm also checking out the Metroid Prime remaster, which just recently came out. So far, fantastic. It's a really good remaster, and uh, I'll be doing more of that. And then, yeah, typically to wind down, I'll do something like this. As long as I haven't gone over time, uh, I'll... I have Animal Crossing as my, my chill game for the time being, so that's that's my plan for tomorrow, if you would like to join. Otherwise, uh, you can also find me on YouTube. Uh, just search for the same channel name as here over on YouTube, and you'll find three channels. The one you'll probably be interested in is the one with past streams. Uh, currently, I believe Stardew, my playthrough of Stardew Valley is like being published every second day and then there's a bunch of other games I'm, I've played. Go have a look. I'm sure you'll find something you're interested in. But if you don't, it's all good. All right, uh, I'm gonna stop talking. But yeah, YouTube, if you're watching later, thanks for tuning in. And yeah, I'll uh, hopefully see some of you tomorrow. Take care, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. And uh, yeah.
be good. Be healthy. <laughs> that felt so awkward. I don't know. Just, uh, yeah. Thanks for tuning in. <laughs>